Yo, what's the deal, YouTube? It's your boy Cartier, man. We're gonna make this pretty quick and simple, or at least we're gonna try to make this pretty quick and pretty simple, as always. We're gonna try to show y'all how to change y'all's tail light colors, or y'all's blinkers, or y'all headlight colors, any color in your car for the lights. We're gonna try to show y'all how to do that. Um, there's some YouTube videos out there, you might be able to go and find them, and they might be able to assist you. But everything that I only looked up wasn't really easy to assist me until I found like this one video which he didn't really explain too much for me but he gave me a basic idea how to do it and then from there I just kind of you know figured it out so if you're not able to figure it out with our tutorial of course you can always go figure it out somewhere else um, but like I said we're gonna try to keep it pretty basic pretty easy to do so go ahead and pull up y'all's uh content manager and we will go from there all right so first things first you're gonna want to open your content manager up go ahead and just load in a map it doesn't matter what map of course uh, and then load up your car that you're wanting to change the lights on all right once you get that car go ahead and just open up the folder and you're gonna go to extension and you're gonna grab this extension uh, config right here and it'll pull up this okay so after you have this, of course you're going to want to go ahead and load in. Okay, now you can choose how you do this step right here, however you want. You can either open up showroom before you load into the game, or you can do it after. It doesn't matter. On a single player, you load in pretty quick. Anyways, you're going to want to open up showroom. Now this isn't something you have to do, but it does help. Okay, the reason it helps is because you're able to click on the car and figure out what is what all right so that's what we're gonna do here give us a second while we try to get this car position right it's not wanting to work with us right now Once you got your car in the showroom, hopefully yours is looking a little better than mine. I don't know what's going on in my mind right now, but basically you just want to be in a showroom. That way you can be able to click on the car and look at different car parts. Okay. So after you are got that pulled up and you are in your game, what, what I like to do first is I like to make sure that these car lights are on. That way I can decipher what exactly I need to be clicking for what I'm trying to change. So these ones here, these are some purple tail, these are some purple tail lights with uh, regular, uh, the blue regular lights, but then I got the uh, purple turning signals. Okay. And also have it on the mirrors, you just can't see it of course. Another step you want to take real quick is just go ahead and go down to, to night for your day at, at night so you can see them better. Alright, so. I like to make sure the lights are on just to make sure I know what I need to click okay so you can see what area of it is you need to click okay what I mean by that is when you go back to your showroom here this area here that's basically my tail light here from that top and then to the bottom it looks like a little bit yep those little cuffs right there little C's so that helps me indicate what I need to be looking for right so when you're in the showroom you click on that part they need click it a few times so this one says R glass 4 yeah it says R glass 4 on this side right here just remember that that might be the name of what I need to change but we're not too sure because the ones we see for the lights is that full round as well so I'm just gonna keep clicking through these just to see what we get and we get R lights 1 Let's see if we can get okay so R glass 5 we got R lights 2 so you see how you just gotta a good couple of different different ones of them so every car is going to be different of course some might be more complicated than others some might not be as complicated the main thing you need to do when you're looking to change the lights 
is you just need to figure out what part of the light is called and then after that you just need to go into the config file and find where it says colors and change the color tone so we'll get into that here so we're gonna pull up this here and for example whenever we've seen what's our glass so it's our underscore glass so you got this here but as you can see there's no color change option go down so all right so this one has a color change right here so we're able to find one of them so this one is the drl tail lights name is r glass 5 and r glass 4 so that means it's probably gonna be linked to the, the left and the right um, but the tested here basically you have this color tone here i do believe i changed this so this should be it here for this car of course so for an example the colors are of course r g b what I just highlighted is going to be the first number R, second number uh, G, last number B, red, green, blue. Last number is going to be how bright you want the colors to stand out. So it looks like for us we're at 13, 15, 200. I'm pretty sure that's because mainly purple. So we're going to go ahead and put this to zero. And we're going to put red to zero as well for purposes of the video. And we're going to make the green section. 222 just for testing and it should make one of these lights green in the back here and then after that i always like to highlight it just to make sure i know where, what, I, what i changed there of course you can always just control z if you want to revert but you're going to go ahead and save it then go back into your game you see how it already changed now if you're doing this in an online game of course it'll change as well once you change it but it's better to do it in a single player that way you don't get kicked out the lobby so as you can see it changed the full backlight of the headlight or the tail lights back here for both sides uh, so as i just stated that was most likely what it was well we know what it was it was for it now a thousand percent but uh, at the time of course i didn't know for sure because well, we don't know the names of the left side over there so as you can see we still got the purple blinkers here all right but we got the green tail light so that tells you right there that changed that okay so now First of the video, I'm gonna go back to what we had it at. Because I want to keep my purple, of course, but of course you'll change it to whatever you want. And of course, some of these lights will be easier to find, some of them might not be easier to find. 